The National Company Law Tribunal is a quasi-judicial body in India that adjudicates issues relating to Indian companies. The NCLT was established under the Companies Act 2013 and was constituted on 1 June 2016 by the Government of India and is based on the recommendation of the Justice Arati Committee on Law Relating to Insolvency and Winding Up of Companies. All proceedings under the Companies Act, including proceedings relating to arbitration, compromise, arrangements and reconstruction and winding up of companies shall be disposed of by the National Company Law Tribunal. The National Company Law Tribunal is the adjudicating authority for insolvency resolution process of companies and limited liability partnerships under the Insolvency and Bankruptcy Code, 2016. No civil court shall have jurisdiction to entertain any suit or proceeding in respect of any matter which the tribunal or the appellate tribunal is empowered to determine by or under this Act or any other law for the time being in force and no injunction shall be granted by any court or other authority in respect of any action taken or to be taken in pursuance of any power conferred by or under this Act or any other law for the time being in force, by the tribunal or the appellate tribunal. The NCLT has 13 benches, two at New Delhi one being the principal bench and one each at Ahmedabad, Allahabad, Bengaluru, Chandigarh, Chennai, Guwahati, Hyderabad, Jaipur, Kochi, Kolkata and Mumbai. Justice M.M. Kumar, a retired Chief Justice of the Jammu and Kashmir High Court has been appointed as President of the NCLT The NCLT has the power under the Companies Act to adjudicate proceedings, initiated before the Company Law Board under the previous Act the Companies Act 1956, pending before the Board for Industrial and Financial Reconstruction including those pending under the Sikh Industrial Companies Special Provisions Act, 1985, pending before the Appellate Authority for Industrial and Financial Reconstruction, and pertaining to claims of oppression and mismanagement of a company, winding up of companies and all other powers prescribed under the Companies Act. Appeals Decisions of the NCLT may be appealed to the National Company Law Appellate Tribunal The decisions of NCLAT may be appealed to the Supreme Court of India on a point of law. The Supreme Court of India has upheld the Insolvency and Bankruptcy Code in its entirety. <laughs> 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 <laughs>